Hi Torin, welcome back to Dream Tarot. I'm here to do your next 48 hours. Yeah, okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> Guys, I'm all over the place right now because I'm not home. I spent the night in my friend's house and I need to push out y'all readings and it's getting pretty late and I need to push out your readings. So thank God I brought my cards with me. So we're gonna be doing a very unprofessional um, next 48 for you if this is your first time with me thank you so much for clicking my video even if you're returning thank you so much for your support Torin you guys support me so much all right so I want to make sure at least I got your video out today and if it doesn't pull up today that's because it took forever to upload but I don't think it will I'm gonna try to just get yours out all right so like I said I'm at my friend's house his kids are here too and they're really um fond of me so if I get interrupted I'm sorry <laughs> but I need to get this out for you guys I need to do a reading I haven't done a reading all day actually I did reading for myself this morning but it was boring it goes about my day and obviously my day is boring because I'm just here so I need to see what's going on with my torrents all right so I'm just shuffling the cards I already blessed these cards um I pre-shuffled them already a little bit earlier but I want to shuffle them for your energies so let's see what's going on with you and then we're also going to see what's going on with your romantic interest also torn if at any time this video res resonates with you if you just have a good time with me kicking it here please like the video comment down below even if it's just a hello and subscribe for further videos okay because your next 48 will be pushed out in a couple of days also if you're interested if you find you are fond of me and you do want to book me i am doing 15 dollars reading very cheap okay the information's in the description box all right all right, I gotta take all my decks out. We're using three decks today, okay? You know if you've been here before, but if you haven't, you're gonna see. I think you're gonna like it. All right, let's get started, y'all. I can't wait any longer. Also, I'm playing, I usually play music to channel messages, whatever, but I'm playing a 90s hip hop list off of YouTube right now. So the beginning message for you is Juicy by Notorious B.I.G., okay? Biggie, Biggie Small, so. Either you've been listening to Biggie Smalls a lot lately, or you feeling real juicy, or somebody thinks you got that juicy. I don't know. <laughs> you know Justin Bieber, you got that yummy. Someone feel like you got that juicy. You got that wop, okay? I don't know. <laughs> That's for somebody. Or you feeling real um, juicy? I don't know. Something you ate today was juicy. <laughs> All right, let me stop. All right, let's, let me, can I be... Can I be mature for once? Also, this is gonna be real ghetto, real ratchet, this reading because I don't have a table right now and I'm not, I'm trying to hide from the children. So, <laughs> um, I'm in the bedroom right now, which is not the most ideal place to do a reading and I don't have my um, camera stand at all. So, uh, I'm just propped up right now. So just bear with me, but I think it'll be okay. All right, guys, we're gonna get started. I've been talking enough. I've been talking enough. Let's see what's going on with you, Torn. What's your energy for the next 48 hours? What's going on with my Torns? What's their energy for the next 48 hours, please? All right, I'm gonna do two more shuffles then I'll pull for you guys. I'm gonna do four cards. All right, the first card out of the deck is going to be the full card. So you could be dealing with an Aquarian, okay? Or you could be thinking about making a new decision. You're thinking, you're thinking about making a new beginning with someone. Or you could be just stuck trying to make a decision between you and this person or you. And just doing something. It doesn't have to be a person. It could be a choice, okay? The next card I pulled out the deck for you is the Nine of Cups. So it seems like you're very happy right now, Torin. Are you going to be? So that's that makes me smile. Okay, so what else do we have? You have the five of cups here but it looks like you have a loss of some so let's see what's going on or you went through having a loss through something but maybe this i don't know maybe this made you happy or to be happy you had to give up something yeah the death card is here to be happy you have to give up something here okay so you could be dealing with a aquarius a piscean a scorpion or a yeah it's a lot of scorpion energy here maybe you had to give up the scorpio all right guys so let's clarify these cards. Why are you guys starting off with the Fool card right here? It looks like you're stuck. You know you want to be happy, but you have to give up something. You might not be ready for that. 
So let's clarify the cool. The, I said the cool card. The, <laughs> the full card for my Taurus. Hope you guys are doing good, by the way. Looks like you're going to be doing good, but something, a decision you need to make here. So what's the full card for my Taurus? What's the full card here? All right, it's the Seven of Pentacles. So you're you're watching something that you invested in long term or you're sitting on top of something. You're sitting on this decision that you need to make, okay? Let me get one more card. The song playing for you, by the way, right now is um, International Players Anthem. <laughs> Torrin, let me not find, let me find out that you are trying to decide whether to um, give up someone like give up your player ways to be with someone or you're deciding to either go back to this player that you don't trust or you're deciding to leave this player but I feel like you're trying to think about dropping all your options for this one special person <laughs> let me find out okay what else is going on here what's the full card oh god yeah okay you have the justice card here so Something needs to give. You know you need to make decision. It's now or never is what I'm feeling from this. The cherry is here. You know you're going to find a lot of success with this person or with this decision. But I really feel like it's a person because the player card came out. The Aquarian card came out again. Star card. So you could be thinking about this Aquarian. Maybe that's who you want to be with. Or you're thinking about giving up this Aquarian. Or you want to be with this Aquarian. You're dropping all your options for this person. But this person is your dream person. This person could be someone in the spotlight. This could be someone who... It's just your dream. Like, this is your dream girl, dream boy. Okay? Four of Pentacles is here. So, you're holding on to this. It's like you're holding on to being a player or you're holding on to this person and they're being a player. Okay? It could be vice versa. And you have the Seven of Wands here. So, you're trying to defend yourself from, from dropping your options, Soren. Or your person's trying to... I, I don't know. I feel like you're defending yourself from this position. But from this decision, you're going to have to be make a new position. You're going to be playing a new position play player i keep saying like i feeling player energy heavily okay this card came out too the page of pentacles you're really sitting on this decision whether to give up your options or to chase this person i don't know what the hell this is all right we're gonna put all these cards back in the deck that's a lot of cards to come out but we're gonna clarify the seven of pentacles here so what are you watching here you're watching someone or something very very closely what's the seven of pentacles the dream i'm telling you it's a person you're thinking about being with someone think about giving up all your hoes for this one person Torn. that's what i'm getting and it's cracking me up okay let's continue what's the nine of cups here this person makes you happy or this decision makes you happy okay so what's the nine of cups this could even be a friend i don't know i don't know yeah so you got the seven of swords you're deciding whether to you know pick up this one person or keep all your options i'm telling you i'm not making this shit up okay what's the seven of swords here <laughs> yeah. torrin this is a turn of events since your last reading i mean not really but it's funny okay the seven of swords y'all giving me life okay so you stressed out about dropping all your options or dropping this person or whatever you're, you're whatever you're choosing to do to that you know if you don't choose to do this decision it's going to make you very unhappy it's stressing you out even to drop what you have to drop for this decision okay but you're trusting you trust this person or you trust this decision you know that's going to make you happy so you know that even though it's going to stress you out to drop this shit this could even be a person who's a player that you're dropping you're choosing to drop this person now it's going to stress you as to drop this person. Um, this person could have helped you out a lot monetarily. This person could have helped you out, you know, mentally, you know, been a good friend to you. But you know this person is cheating on you or just a player and you're just like, I'm done. I want to be the only one. So you're trusting your instinct. Okay. What's the five of cups here? All right. Yeah. So you're taking a loss here. What's the loss? What's the loss for Torn? Okay. The full card. When you make this choice, you're going to take a loss. Oh, my God. Or this could be this Aquarian that you're dealing with, Torn. Please comment down below and let me know what's going on here. Are you the player or are you dropping the player? Yeah. We have the King of Cups in reverse. Could be an older male. Could be a player. Could be a Scorpio that you're dealing with. I'm feeling that heavily. Cancer or Pisces. 
but you're dropping this person you don't want the player or you're choosing not to be a player anymore if this is you if this is your energy because we are still on your energy you're choosing to be committed <laughs> why was that hard for me to say i feel like when you say that you like go extra hard you're like committed like you have a hard time saying that okay <laughs> what's the king of cups it's so funny to me y'all what's the king of cups this could be a person too they're choosing to drop all their options for you and you're thinking about it like i know this person's a player the lovers yeah you love this person torn this is your energy so let me know if it's if it's reversed but you know the proof is in the pudding baby it could be a gemini that you're thinking about or you could be making a choice this is an important choice in your life and this person is very important in your life if this is a person you, this person is very important to you so you have to make the right decision i'm not going to clarify the full card because we already got the full card you know in the beginning so let's deal with the death you have to put death to something all right die die <laughs> you have to something has to die here so what's the death card here what's the death card here does anybody have a pet gerbil please tell me that is so i really feel like that's old school okay let me tell you why that's old school because i don't know anyone i don't know anyone now who has a gerbil but if you have a gerbil please let me know because there's a gerbil in this picture and we're in 90s um i'm, li I'm listening to 90s music right now so it's like do you I, and i just said it's old school to have a gerbil so do you have a gerbil or does your person have a gerbil that's so weird i mean it's not weird but it's just unusual like who does anybody have a gerbil let me know anyway <laughs> okay the death card page of swords you're walking away from something you don't want to your defenses are up you're looking back but you're walking away from something or someone okay no more juggling i'm thinking with the two of pentacles let's clarify these cards just to make sure what's the two of pentacles? two of pentacles all right the moon card so you're letting go of secrets okay you you've been or you reject the person that you're dealing with could be having a lot of secrets they're letting go of that okay but i feel like this is you Torin. you were you had a lot of the rebel card is here the emperor okay or you're choosing to let control of something maybe you just didn't want to be in a relationship you just knew that you weren't going to be in a relationship but someone wants to be with you yeah the control you're letting control the control card is down here too so you're letting go of something here because that's the emperor card the rebel card is the emperor card and then the control card came out which is the king of swords you very guarded about your heart maybe because you were hurt in the past and you're just like i just knew i was going to get another relationship but it's funny how life works and how divine sends you shit okay what's the page of swords it's funny how life works torin right all right or could this could even be an ex-lover that she said i'm not going back to and now you're like falling from them again you have the empress card here so you're probably falling for someone very much someone could be fertile right now so you could be having really crazy <laughs> you could have <laughs> you could be having like really crazy like sex with this person right now <laughs> you don't want to go back to this person you're like oh hell no like they fucked me up before and i don't want to do it again but i feel like you can't resist this person because the empress card is here is like it's un this person is unresistible to you okay you can't deny this person is what i'm getting all right all right, I'm going to clean up this, and then we're going to go into what's going on with your romantic interest for the next 48 hours. All right, so sorry, guys. The way I was looking crazy is because um, a kid came in, so <laughs> I had to go handle that. All right, no, I'm just kidding. But we're going to get right into what's going on with your romantic interest. So, Torin, this sounds a little crazy. It's like somebody is dropping their player ways either for you, but this is your energy, so maybe you just didn't think you were gonna fall for anybody for the end of the year you're just like i'm done with love but this person brings you a lot of happiness and now you're choosing whether to you know get with this person more intimately or more romantically or more seriously is what i meant to say but it's like you don't know if you want to because you're going to take a loss of something or this could not even be romantically wise this could mean like making a major decision in your life where you're gonna have kind of less control of your life that you had before and it's gonna change your life dramatically but you know it's gonna make you happier but it's also gonna bring you a loss of things that you usually enjoyed or the freedom you usually enjoyed before okay so let's see what's going on with your person or your romantic interest homeboy homegirl okay <laughs> for the next 48 hours let's see what's going on with them all right 
I'm gonna shuffle quite a bit. The song I'm playing for you right now is Mo Money, Mo Problems. So yeah, I feel like this is a good thing. Like it's gonna, I feel like this is gonna give, your decision could not be romantic wise. It could be like about money. So it's like, you know, either moving in with someone maybe, and you know, that you can't be the usually player player that you usually are. Or this could be um, accepting a position, but you're losing control. Like you're gonna have, be working more hours over time or you're gonna be salary based. So now it's like, it doesn't matter what hours you're working because you're salary based now. So you're working overtime just to, you know, make ends meet, even though it's, it's going to be better on your paycheck. But you're like, damn, I was enjoying just, you know, having my free time now I might not have no free time. So I don't know what it is, but I think that you're making the right decision by being responsible and going towards this thing, because obviously this thing makes you happy or it's going to bring happiness to you. Something that you, you know, it's like filling a void. And it doesn't have to be a big void. It could be very small. It could be this small. But it's filling a void that was in your life, okay? So anyway, on to your person. On to homeboy, homegirl. What are they doing for the next 40 hours? What's their energy, okay? I'm going to shuffle one more time because I've been shuffling this whole time. All right, top of the deck. We have the king of swords, okay? <laughs> Someone might be mad at you right now, I'm seeing, or cold towards you, okay? Could be an uh, air sign. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Um, but the King of Cups is here. It looks like somebody either wants... Oh, sorry. Dropped it. Should have been holding it that way. It's, it's like somebody either wants to talk to you or give you an apology, maybe. Or, you know, mend things with you is what I'm seeing here. But they're being very slow. Even though the King of Cups could be... He's not really that slow, but... If you see this person, they in a fucking wheelchair. But it looked like she could pick the fuck up. And I'm sorry if anybody has a disability. I'm not making a joke. But I'm just saying. I'm talking about the movement here. Like, this person is slow to bringing it towards you, okay? Oh, shit. <laughs> the Four of Pentacles is here. So, this is someone who wants to take control of their life to me. But this is also someone taking control. So, I feel like your energy does intertwine with your person because it's like somebody's taking control your person's taking control and you're losing control okay so hmm i feel like this does have to deal with your person okay let's keep going okay and then your person is also the queen of cups so this person has a lot of emotion for you we have the king of swords which is someone who could be very distant but when the king of swords is put up with the king of cups and the queen of cups that's heavy energy and like i said your person could be a um, cancer pisces scorpio and or uh, um, we haven't had pentacle energy so that's capricorn Taurus, um and capricorn Taurus, virgo sorry yeah and then we have aquarius um aquarius libra gemini jesus <laughs> girl get it the fuck out all right anyway the king of swords is here for my Taurus um romantic interest let's see why your person is acting like they too good to talk to you right now or hang out with you or they just got an attitude with you. I'm feeling more attitude than just being cold as fuck because you cannot be cold and have the King of Cups and the Queen of Cups. Like, pick a side, you know? You <laughs> Pick a side, baby. Hi, Torin. I'm so sorry. <laughs> My um, friend walked in and when they walked in, they were like, <gasps> and I just laughed, so sorry. I had to stop it, but we didn't even get started. So we're still on the King of Swords. Okay, that's your person's energy. This person's acting cold right now or acting like they have an attitude, okay? So why is your person the King of Swords torn for the next 48 hours? All right, the Hierophant. So this person obviously wants a commitment. Commit went. This is your person obviously wants a commitment from you, okay? And the Strength card. So they're trying to have the courage to ask you this or the courage... For re your person is already feeling rejected from you because maybe you maybe you left them hanging with the answer like you was just like i'll let you know <laughs> this is not funny y'all but it's just like damn your person really wants a commitment from you Torin. all right so let's see what's going on what's the hierophant card whoa okay all right, we got enough cards to clarify the strength card and and um, the strength the strength card and the hierophant. So we have the Queen of Wands here. Could be dealing with the um, fire sign Aries, Leo, Sagittarius here. Okay, but somebody wants to 
some passion from you they're trying to man they're manifesting you your person could also be very sexy or they think that you're very sexy okay because the queen of wands is a very beautiful confident queen very sexy queen very alluring person okay someone with a lot of passion okay in reverse we have the death this is the death card but it's also transformation so it's like this person doesn't want this to end okay maybe they're scared that you are trying to end things with them and they don't want it to end we have the nine of cups in reverse so this is also like and this is the laziness card in reverse so if this person is really trying to make an action they're being by very direct with what they want from you maybe this person tells you exactly what you you know they're very confident with the queen of wands being here this person has no problem telling you what they want from you very very um direct person very um outspoken so maybe that kind of puts you off a little bit torn yeah this person is very intense is what i'm trying to say so this person is the knight of wands this person is very fast moving direct action very passionate very flirtatious with you tells you exactly what they want from you this person could be like i want commitment now okay you have the sun card which is also the past life so the person wants you to drop all your options here drop all those options for me this is the sun card in this deck too so this person wants positivity positivity happiness with you they want to be a happy couple with you they want a couple the four of wands here let's make a home together let's be a couple let's bring this in commitment okay the next step so if you're already in a commitment with this person like as in boyfriend girlfriend they want the ring you know what i'm saying or vice versa you may want the ring you're ready for that and they know that now okay they know that so the king of cups is here why is the king of cups here for your person i feel like your person is um very direct with you but i feel like they're in their feelings because either you just said like you're not ready for a commitment or you're just you're taking your time because of your past okay so what's the king of cups here for your person for the next 40 hours okay this is the page of wands here so your person wants you and only you they don't see anybody else they don't have any other options they're very focused on you and they have a lot of passion for you so they're like hello do you feel the same for me or are you still dating these other tricks in the street <laughs> Let's play it for y'all right now. Hypnotize. I don't know why this is all biggie music. Is that all we have from the 90s? I mean, I'm not against it, but hypnotize. So you got this person hypnotized. This person is literally obsessed with you, okay? Damn, the obsession is real. What else can we get for the King of Cups? You have the two of wands. So this person wants to move forward. They're not looking at anybody else. If they had options before, they're like, okay, I only want touring. This person's really focused on you right now. What's the page of wands? You are this person's only... You feel this, too, in your energy, Taurus. You feel like, damn, this person ain't got no other... They ain't got no other hoes. They ain't got no other bitches. Like, damn, you all in my body. But I feel like you like it, though. <laughs> it makes you happy that this person only has you. But the page of wands here, they only want you, but they're mad that they only want you or they only have you as your, their only option because they feel like you're not focused on them. Okay? Or this could be vice versa. What's the two of wands here? So your person is the king of swords, the queen of swords, the king of cups, and the queen of cups. This person, I feel like it can black out on you at any time, and then just right after that, they'd be like, I love you. <laughs> That's why I blacked out. All right, postponement. So this person feels like you are postponing this. You're not paying attention to them. You don't have any love for them, even though they are a great option. They feel like they're your best option, actually. This person feels like they're your best option. This person could have been waiting on you for a long time. This could be someone that you don't, that's a friend who wants to be more than a friend, Torin. Okay? And you know it deep down inside, but you refuse to acknowledge it. What's the Four of Pentacles here? So this is the Four of Pentacles. So this person's trying to take control of the situation or of their life. They could have went through a lot recently, and now they're trying to take control of their life. And you could see this, and you could be like the only person in their corner helping them. Maybe this is why they fell for you. Or this could be someone trying to take control of you, okay? This person could be very controlling. All right, so let's see what's going on with the Four of Pentacles here. All right, so the Nine of Pentacles is here. Somebody sees you as a bad bitch or just a hot nigga, okay? Whichever category you fall on. This person watches you very much. This person tends to you and caters to you, okay? This person could cook for you. This person probably cleans up after you. This person washes your clothes, folds it. This person would 
sniff your dirty draws basically okay <laughs> this person really loves you really nurtures you very nurturing person okay and then but they're in their head about all this that they're doing for you because they feel like they don't feel like it's not reciprocated but they're like okay when are we going to move on to the next step okay so let's clarify these cards what's the nine of pentacles here for your person torn what's the nine of pentacles this person loves your dirty draws i'm hearing like loves them this person's in their mind, four of swords, okay? But this is the um, page of swords, okay? They're in their mind. They're like, should I even give you my love anymore? Do you even care? Do you even want it? And this person is trying to compromise. So I feel like you guys are equal here. Y'all do compromise in a relationship, but someone's not happy. Like, someone doesn't want the next step in the commitment someone still wants to be a free man free woman but then someone does want the next step in a relationship but y'all are choosing to still deal with each other even though y'all have different wants because y'all both love each other all right what's the queen of cups here <laughs> torn this is crazy this is like oh shit this is like a crazy like movie romance right where two people are like, well, it's just not even two people. Like, I feel like this person wasn't trying to fall for you, but they did. And they're like, okay, I'm not playing with you because I'm, a, I'm a, a good option. I feel like this person is a good option, Torrin. So give them a chance. But you might not see that person this way. But I feel like you are romantic with this person or you spend a lot of time with this person. So might as well give it a chance and just see. The full card just popped out of the deck. So yeah, you might want to give it a chance. What's the Queen of Cups here? And if this person's a water sign and touring your earth sign, water nurtures earth. So this person's really a nurturer. They want to heal you from your past. I feel like this person's not going to do you dirty, but you're just not ready for it. So somebody wants to con take control, okay? So this Queen of Cups gives you like a lot of love and nurtures you, but you feel like it's just to take control of you. You feel like this person just like plays games. Like you feel like this person's a good flirt. Or you feel like this person is good with their words. Uh, um, they have the gift of gab. And you're just like, I don't know if I can trust you. But I'm feeling it. But I don't know if you're just trying to play me right now. What song is playing for y'all right now? All right. Little Kim, Missy Elliott, The Brat, Left Eye, Angie Martinez, Ladies Night. <laughs> okay, cause, so you could have met this person on Ladies Night or Men's Night or at the gay bar. I'm hearing. Or gay strip club. Or strip club. And it, you met a girl there. This could be girl on girl or boy on boy. But ladies night, it, maybe that's just about having fun and kicking it. So you're just into your zone right now. You're just having fun and kicking it. You just got out of a crazy toxic thing like a couple months ago or a month ago or even some weeks ago. And Well, I don't feel like weeks ago because you've been kicking it with this person for a while. But I feel like you're just not ready or you think you're not ready. But you obviously spend all your time with this person like they're your boo. The three of pentacles is here. So this person gives you a lot of love they want to see you they want to come together they want you guys you guys are very friendly this is someone i'm telling you this is a close friend from you that wants to take things to the next step okay let's see what's going on three of pentacles please three of pentacles you don't pay this person you do pay this person mine but you just want you're just on a friendly level but you know that you have some feelings for this person like this is how i think you know you don't want to be in a commitment, right? But you get jealous about this person. So it's like, this person knows that. And they're like, what the fuck? Going with the flow. You just want to go with the flow right now, Torin. You don't really want to be in a commitment. Okay. And I feel like that's because you've been through something, you know? you definitely been through something. But the Ace of, this is also the Ace of Cups card. So I feel like there's a lot of love that this person could give to you. A lot of love, okay? What is the Four of uh, Pentacles, please? courage okay so you don't want nobody to control you or you feel like this person's trying to control you through their their romance you know this person is very flirtatious this person knows how to talk to you know how to get you aroused this person could be really good with sex like i said and you feel like this person's just trying to take advantage but the courage card came out so obviously you should have better sh like you know this person's not bullshitting you i think this person really does care about you but i think you're so defensive right now i don't know why something that happened in the past maybe your past lover but you're so defensive right now okay i can't i can't stand to look at myself no more with this light <laughs> but it's like you don't want to you don't want to invest in this relationship because you don't know what this person's intentions are you feel like you've dealt with this kind of person before 
and you're like, I can't do this anymore. You know, you're like, I'm not going to go through this again and get my heart broken. Because you're like, the second I give in to this person, they're going to break my heart. But I feel like the courage card would not come out for someone like that or the ace of cups. I feel like this person is not fucking with you. And you might drive a good person away by being just... I don't feel like you're cold to this person, but you just like no commitment here. <laughs> I feel like this person probably does deserve a commitment, but that's up to you. You know um, how this person has treated you, you know, from the very beginning. You know how this person treats you every day. You know their true intentions. I feel like you know this person's heart. So if this person's heart is good, give them a chance. But if not, cut them loose, all right? This has been Dream Tarot. If you enjoyed this reading, <laughs> I know it was a ratchet reading, but Torn, please stick with me. You know I can do better than this, but I had to get your reading out. I'll even do you another reading tomorrow. But <laughs> Torn, if you enjoyed this reading with me, if you had fun, please like the video, comment down below, even if it's just a hello, and subscribe to my channel for your next 48 coming out in a couple of days. I'm also doing $15 readings, very cheap. The info is in the description box, okay? Love you guys. See you in the next one.